Living 808 is at Chef's Zone, back for Hawaii's Kitchen, and we are making up some pizza, not just any pizza today. We're with Jay Dolans here with Nigel and Brendan. All right, so the secret is really the dough, isn't it? It is. Uh, it's a very simple recipe, though. Flour, sugar, water, salt, a little yeast, and a couple other ingredients that I'm not going to tell you make our <laughs> dough a little bit better. Uh, but it's a simple recipe, you know, let it proof for a couple of days, but... Anyone could make it if they really wanted. What do you mean by proof? What exactly is that? Can you walk us through the process? So proofing is a part of the process with dough in which it rises and the yeast activates. Okay. It's part of our big flavor and it's also part of how we get a lot of our texture such as here. Mm -hmm. Makes a lot of like our thinner, softer crust and gives it great flavor. Mm -hmm. Preferably we like to, to proof for about two to three days to give it full. Okay. Sometimes. Um, of course, if not, of course, we make a lot of pizza at the time, so sometimes not. Do you got to proof it with love? Does that help make the taste <laughs> at all? Absolutely, yeah. all the love. Of course, you got to have love in it. I can see you got to do that. And then how do you know when it's just right, the texture of it? You know when the texture is just about right, when it's just about soft enough, mm -hmm. but it's also quite still in the firm state as well. You don't want it too soft, too firm. Okay, yeah. can I? All right, I promise I wash of course, my hands. Of course, take a feel. <laughs> And this, I mean, gosh, I feel like I'm being played over the kids. Yep. They would love this. Yep, exactly. And you said you actually used to do a, a class yep, with kids, right? Yeah, we used right? to do a little kids would come in. They used to have birthdays, come into the kitchen. Everyone could touch the dough, what kind of pizza you want to make. So I don't know if you've ever rolled mozzarella balls, but it's kind of the same. You kind of fold it into itself. Mine is looking bumpy. Uh, it's a little <laughs> bit. Some it, it takes some time. It takes a little practice. How long have you guys been doing this to be this? Uh, I've been at Jay's for... A little over three years now, almost okay. four. And how many do you guys think you made of these balls proofed over the years of your career? Would you oh. know? Could you even give uh, a ballpark? A huge probably, number. <laughs> probably not. <laughs> now, um, if people want to work with you, do they have to, you know, do some perfectly shaped balls? This wouldn't cut it. Would that you? would not cut it, no. <laughs> you need a little bit more practice. <laughs> so try and fold it in on itself. Can you bring it down? You make it look easy. It's not that easy, I'm telling you. <laughs> And then you just pinch off the end, so there's no air bubbles. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed to show mine. Do not get a there close up of this. Wow, that looks great. That, that might not work. So it would still taste the same, <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah, it would taste or the same in a couple absolutely. of days. No one would know the difference. Okay, now what are we going to be making? Because we want to turn this into one of your awesome pizzas. All right, so our first first pizza is a Giacomo. It's probably our most most purchased, most bought. A little cornmeal on the stick. Okay. So the pizza doesn't, you know, so it slides right off. It's like mm, little ball bearings. Fish, yeah. And we get a dough right here. Is that what happens to this? That is what happens, yes. In, In a perfect world? Two or three days, yeah. Two or three days. It turns wow. into that. Boom. Put it in a little bit of flour so it doesn't stick to anything. Get these out of the way. You can keep that one if you want. <laughs> Let's just huck this one out of here. No one wants to see this so, monstrosity. Stretch it. Cornmeal down. See, I have envy. I've watched guys like twirling it and stuff, and I yeah, feel like I can do uh, that, but now I know I can't do it. I mean, we, you can throw it in the air if you want, but that's almost just for show, to be oh, honest. Oh, is that really? Yeah, is that like a trade secret? That's not eh, a it's kind of just... It's more of just the show and the entertainment of it all. Yeah. All right, we're going to keep this going. Brendan and Nigel are going to show us how to make up this pizza, not just for show. When we come back on Living 808, we are going to put this in the oven and get to do the taste test. Okay, so... Uh, I know you're going to make fun of me. <laughs> Go ahead. Take your best shot. <laughs> your dough ball didn't quite look like their dough ball. No. It was lumpy and quite sad, actually. But they were able to fix it. Yeah. Delicious smelling, too. So we're going to get that. They're going to pick up the Giacomo. And also, you're, you're biting your tongue. You want to say something? <laughs> Don't. Yeah, no. I'm going to refrain. Okay, good. <laughs> <laughs> From pizza to popcorn. Moving on. Yep. Later, what's popping in theaters? Including the newest superhero. But first...